Hello guys, it's me B. How you doing? Um, I'm feeling a lot better today. Uh, today is the 20th, December 20th, and I had my surgery on the 15th. So I've been five days post-op. Post-op. Um, things that I've noticed um, during these days. Um, due to the fact that I I was a big chest person, I just couldn't, I mean binding, I could bind, but binding was not enough. And gyms are full of mirrors, right? So it was really difficult for me to just go to a certain place and exercise. I just couldn't see myself. I did not recognize the person that I was seeing. So I stopped exercising. I've I have always been a very active person. I used to be a swimmer. Um, I was, I was even in the the varsity team when I, when I, when I was in an exchange program in Minnesota. And I I used to be a surfer, so I was I've always been very active. But I, <coughs> these during these past years, I simply could not. Uh, exercise and I'm feeling it right now it's been really difficult for me like leaving the bed leaving the bed I, 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 I need help to leave bed I just you know I just using my legs it's not is not enough I need to use my abs my ab and I just don't feel I don't know and maybe I just Maybe I, I am strong enough to do that, but I, since I haven't exercised lately, I just don't feel uh, confident to to try to try doing it by myself. Um, maybe maybe next week I'll I'll just start doing it. Um, it's funny. Um, other things I noticed, for example, I've I've seen in other videos people. Uh, saying like, oh, they look, they look at themselves in the mirror, and they go like, oh, I lost this, but I gained this, and that's exactly how I feel, you know. Um, like my belly looks huge. I know that's also. Um, I mean, constipation plays a role on this, you know, and I'm even taking some, some pills now. They're called Tamarini. They are natural pills, so I could actually, you know, work on number two on Tuesday. So, like, two or three days after, after surgery. Also, my, my girlfriend and, and my friend which are who are here with me like almost all the time they've been helping me helping me a lot and <laughs> they're such they're such great companions and they keep telling me that I right now I am their victim so I can actually choose what I'm going to eat so they prepare what I'm eating and it's it's difficult to do basic things right to, just to grab something in the refrigerator or in the closet so they are the ones who are um, giving me what to eat so today for example I have I'll, I'll show you guys so this is my dish today so I have some lettuce potatoes soy meat i'm a vegetarian so i don't i don't eat meat and rice with some salt and um and some oil yeah but very very simple and water yeah i've been drinking lots of water um it's pretty hot in rio like tomorrow tomorrow is summer so 
today the temperature is like 40 degrees Celsius and I basically have to stay inside the bedroom because it's the only place where we have an AC and <clears throat> what else um, well, yeah so I, I don't know if it's related to having the, the tube inside when you're having surgery but my my throat is awful like I, I'm always doing like <coughs> and I'm drinking lots of water as I said and also uh, using this spray thing <coughs> I'm sorry which is made of uh, dumb which is made of honey and some herbs and and other things and it's helping me and the doctor told me that I'll probably feel better in a couple of days but the air con the air conditioner definitely does not help my 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 throat but again um there's no chance I can turn the the AC off. You know, it's really, really, really hot. Um, so this is what my chest look like a little bit. Yeah. Um, I'm wearing this sort of bra thing, and you can't really see much. It's difficult to just to stand up straight, you know. I think I'm gonna need. Um, I think I'm I'm gonna need some physiotherapy. You say I think you can say physiotherapy after like I I I keep walking with my shoulders like this way to sort of um, hide my breaths. But now I haven't much to to hide so. I can definitely start walking straight, but I think I'll need to 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 work on to work on that. Um, what else? Um, the size of it. I'm I'm I can't really see much. Like if I mean lots lots of tissue um, have been removed, and I loved the the size of my nipples. They're super, they're super dark, but I loved the the size of them and the size of the the scars as well. But I'm not quite sure about the size of my my breasts itself. So I th I think I'll have to to wait a little bit more. Um, I'm gonna be back at the doctor, uh, the doctor's on the twenty sixth to have the stitches out and I think only on, on the 26th I'll have a, a better idea um, what else uh, this year I, I'll have to you know spend Christmas here at my girlfriend's place um, my mom is probably gonna join us and my brother her family lives in Chile and this year they're not gonna come uh, maybe she's gonna go there in later in in January, but I won't be able to go this time. Yeah, I'll have to to stay and re and recover, right? Recover from from surgery. But let's see. I would love to go to go back there again. Um. So yeah, I'll just you know. Oh, this vi this video is long enough. Um, if you have any questions, if you have any comments, again, please feel free. Uh, uh, yep, yeah, I'll just I'll try to to make another video, a new video on the twenty sixth or right after or right after Christmas. All right, so thank you for watching. And I hope you guys have a great Christmas, a great Christmas day.
Okay? Peace. Bye-bye. Ciao.